everybody welcome back if you're new to the channel thanks uh for checking us out uh today we're going to be getting into new episode of hawkeye episode five it's called ronin um a couple things from last episode jack is confirmed to be a criminal he's just bad news he's laundering money for the tracksuit mafia which i still think is a funny gang the way how many times do they say bro when they talk i don't know but I just think they're hilarious. Um, what else happened? Yelena. She's got to want to talk to Clint about something. Because if not, she would have killed him on the rooftop. She could have killed everybody up there. No problem. But she wants to talk to him about something. Probably to get the specifics as to what happened to Natasha. I'm not exactly sure. But uh, I'm anxious to see what's going to happen there. So let's just get right into it, huh? Nice. Starting off with Yelena. Is she freeing widows right now? Please tell me she's mind controlled, right? to help you look what you did to my rug i don't think she was brainwashed what you thought i was some rich pervert's prisoner huh well yeah kind of how can you afford all of this by doing the thing we're all best at killing for money excuse me i guess end game hasn't happened yet It was five years, but for her, it was a flash. Oh, wow. That's crazy. What's happening? What's going on? Who are you? Who are you? Elena? Oh my God, you're back. Okay, at least she's in a friendly place where this happened. Sonia, who left my house in much less dramatic fashion than you did that day, realized this, and now you will too. You can start with contract work. Okay, stop. It's Anna. I was in there for five seconds. I come out, and I've lost five years of my life. Please. I'm sorry, Elena. I was just trying to help you. I need to find Natasha. Can you help me find Natasha? I need to tell her I'm okay. Oh, man. I don't know if I want to see her finding out. Are you okay? Does this have anything to do with Clint Barton? Mom, no. Clint protected me. And you'll be glad to know he then told me to come home and stay away from him. She just wants to help. Does Clint think you are a superhero? No. I don't either. So if you have taken away her spirit. I, I really thought I could be one of them. I already are. I need to tell you something. Clint and I have been looking into our mom's murder. We found a lot of incriminating stuff about Jack, Mom. Including this shell company that he has called Sloan Limited. Maybe there's a, a reason for all of it. I don't know. But you just have to please just promise me that you'll look into it. That's all I ask. Okay, I will. Everything's burnt. Frickin' tracksuit mafia. Excuse me. <gasps> Get to the show. <laughs> Hi. I made macaroni if you want some. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Well, I was starving and you took forever, so I wanted to make food. <laughs> yes, Elena. Relax, Kate Bishop. I just want to talk, okay? Are you really not hungry? That fight was so long. It's really tasty. Really tasty. Yeah, I know what box mac and cheese tastes like. Okay, I know it's, you know, it's delicious. Uh, you have one pork? I'm one person. That's so weird. Kate, this is not cutlery. This is not cutlery. I am not going to just sit and have dinner with you after you tried to kill me and then just broke into my house. I did not try to kill you. A, yeah. I put you on a wire to remove an obstacle. And B, I did not break anything. I am way too talented than that. And C, stop being so defensive. Okay? You're so hostile. Kate, please. My daddy says it's good for you. 
They were probably thinking, what? This is crazy. I'm going to have dinner with the enemy. And she made some really good smelling macaroni. But in all honesty, if I wanted to kill you, I You would have already. Right as you open the door. Yeah, I probably wouldn't have even had time to shut it. No. I'd have been dead. No. Right okay. Mm. Might as well figure out what's going on. Hello? Hey, Grills, it's Clint. Can I come up? Oh my god, yeah, yeah, come up. He's going to see the LARPing guy? You ever think about a name for your dog? Oh. Well, the dog's there. Are you done? <laughs> yeah. I go? Sure can. I can put hot sauce on it? <laughs> oh, I love hot sauce. Yes. So what do you want? Your character's the well, best. Well, it's my first time in New York. But it's a business trip, so time is limited. But I do want to see some things. I want to see uh, the Empire State Building and the Rockefeller Center. <laughs> Very funny. What, it's not good? Oh, no, they're... They're great. Yeah, you, I mean, you, you've got to see the tree. Mm. Yeah, the exactly. Christmas tree. See? I love American Christmases. The tree, the presents, the super-powered reindeer, Rudolph. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. He is so weird. <laughs> I guess he does have superpowers. I never thought of it. But hey, Kate Bishop, you grew up here, right? You must have some recommendations for me. I'm not quite sure those are the right fit for the bloodthirsty vigilante type. <laughs> They're bad bloodthirsty vigilante. <laughs> Sometimes you're funny, Kate Bishop. Do you keep saying my whole name just to point out that you know it? Yes. Are you in New York to talk to Clint? Is that why you're here? No, 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 no. I'm here to kill him. Oh. I have a question for you. What is it? Why do you risk your life for him, Clint Barton? How has everybody forgiven him for his past? He saved the world. No. My sister saved the world. Natasha Romanoff, she saved the world. She did. Stop pretending like you're not surprised. It does not look cool. You're really Natasha's sister? Yes. Wow, I did not see that coming. Like, thank God I didn't kill you up there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Kate Bishop, you are so funny. That's hilarious. <laughs> that one is the funniest. <laughs> <laughs> Natasha and Clint were friends. Why are you after him? You are so fond of him. He tells me you don't really know who he is. He came here to protect his reputation. It's partly true. Do you know how many people he killed? When you face the kind of threats that he has, there's going to be collateral damage. My sister is gone because of him. No, no, that is no. She's gone. Do you know the full story? Is she collateral damage. No, look, there is no way that that is true. He would not let that happen. How long have you known Clint Barton? Just a couple days. About a week. It will not be difficult for me to complete this assignment. Wait a minute, somebody hired you to kill him? Mm -hmm. All I'll say is that if there's someone out there that is telling you Clint is a bad guy, then maybe you should ask yourself what kind of person hired you. He's he not true. perfect. Nobody's perfect, but he is good. At least talk to him. Get the story from him. We are defined by what we do, not by nice words. Like it or not, there is no escaping this. Again, you can see both sides. Thank you for the girls' night, truly. He's gonna go out the window. Oh, and Kate Bishop, do not get in my way again. <laughs> Talk about being a poser. I oh, really appreciate it. Thank you. You think you could um, look after the dog just for a few more days? Thank you. Here, bud. Almost forgot. Missy dropped off the new outfits for you and Kate. You want to see them? Oh, there's new outfits? No, I, I want to see these new outfits. I'm gonna need you to come in and ask some questions. I've never worked a day in my life. Well, we have some tax records that are about to do. I'm so sorry, Mom. I looked into it, honey, and you were right. I don't blame you for calling the police, darling. I would have done exactly the same thing. I've obviously been framed. I'll clear all this up and be back in a jiffy for your Christmas party. You'll see. Huh? 
Natasha, I really need to talk to you right now. You were the bravest of us all. Do my best every day to earn what you gave me. I just want to say I miss you. And I'm so sorry for what I'm about to do. What is he about to do? What is he going to do? I don't know. I'm nervous now. He's apologizing to her beforehand. Who knows what he's going to do? You're still going to help him. Hey, listen, I know you said it's over, but it's not. <laughs> not for me. Call me back. We need to talk about the other woman on the roof, not Maya. No, the other one. I don't want to say too much on the phone. Call me back. So the police arrested Jack. It's all pretty crazy. Would be great to discuss. <laughs> yeah, okay, sure. I've screwed up a few times. Okay, fine. <laughs> Whatever. I'm still learning. Whoa. This isn't over, Barton. I'm gonna find you. <laughs> My box is full and cannot accept any messages at this time. <gasps> Trust a bro. Here we go. Oh my god, I love these guys. Run DMC's classic tracks. Classic, classic. Classic. Somehow I think Barton's gonna hit them. You know what you don't see anymore? Tell me. Brass knuckles. What are you gonna do, huh? Pull them out of your pocket in the middle of a fight? Wait one second, please. Let me put on brass knuckles so I can punch your face. Yeah, I thought so. Oh. <laughs> Maya, meet me tonight where you first met Roman. Hey. We need to talk. No fun conversations ever started that way. I'm sorry. This problem just keeps getting bigger. Maya is relentless. She's got her hands on the watch. She looked into our family. Someone has hired a black widow. How do you want to think about where this all goes? It is snowballing. I mean, the kids and I are so far away. It's not far enough. If I don't end this tonight, it's just a matter of time before the big guy gets involved. Jesus. Big guy? Sure. Who's that? Then follow your gut. I trust your judgment. Oh boy. Do what you have to do. Here we go. And know that I'll always understand more than anybody else ever could. I love you. She's got some sort of past. Goodness. Are we gonna find out what it is? Did she actually come alone? Nope. Ace behind you. <laughs> Saw that coming. That's Tom. Oh, damn. I feel bad for these guys. Because they're not necessarily evil, they're just gangsters. <laughs> I was waiting for a bro. Man, she's got the moves. Damn, dude. She is good. Nice. Dude. For her to be able to do this with a prosthetic is insane. He's gonna show her. No. But if you or anyone comes after me and my family, it'll be the last thing you do. You have my word. <laughs> what? Yes. Your boss. Your boss wanted your father dead. Now he's using <laughs> Shit. Yeah, Kate. Oh, 
Damn, you good. Watching his back, even though he didn't call for it. So this rescue mission, you got an escape plan? Hey, are you Tabitha? Yes. All right, hop on in. An Uber. Awesome. That was some upsetting news that he gave her. Thank God. What are you talking about? Oh. Oh. She's not going to trust anybody now. One more thing we should worry about. You remember the girl from last night, the one in the, the mask? Uh -huh. Um, I spoke to her. Natasha's sister. She said she's Natasha's sister. The changes things for Clint. Elena. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. He understands. Okay. All right. Yeah. Did she set up Sloan? And why are you following her? What's going on here? Oh, good job. Where is it? Oh! Kate? Look at this. Who's that with my mom? No way, is it Julie Louis Dreyfus? Well, that's the guy I've been worried about this whole time. Oh! Kingpin. What? Kingpin? You're a mean one. What the actual fuck? Um. Okay, uh, Kingpin? I guess that's how Daredevil's gonna tie back into the Marvel Universe. But that's, that's mind-blowing. Kingpin. And does that, does Barton's wife have some sort of connection to Kingpin? I feel like she has some sort of past that's going to be blown up in the finale. And I think a lot of stuff was set up in this episode for the finale. And I can't wait for the confrontation between Yelena and Clint to happen. Now that Clint knows who she is. And I still feel like Yelena wants to talk to Clint. Because she, I, I'm not sure she knows the full story as to what actually happened on Vormir's. So I'm excited for that kind of uh, confrontation. If you liked the video, make sure to hit the like button and give us a thumbs up. And if you want to catch our next video, hit the subscribe button. Thanks for coming out, guys. Have a great day.